an engineering marvel is getting its wings clipped. Airbus says the last A380, the world's largest passenger jet, will roll off the factory floor in three years. I use the word painful and I mean it. What we're seeing here is uh, the end of a large four-engine aircraft and that is what it is. Airbus had hoped the 544-seater double-decker would replace rival Boeing 747 as the king of the world's airspace. But a decade after the A380 first took flight, airlines have directed their reverence towards smaller jets that burn less fuel, are easier to fill, and make more money. I mean, there has been speculation uh, for years, whether we were 10 years too early with 380. I think it becomes clear that we were probably at least 10 years too late or more. Demand mainly from Dubai-based Emirates kept A380 production lines running for years. It's bought one-third of the jets that Airbus has sold for $450 million apiece. But Emirates has slashed its most recent order from 53 to 14. Airbus plans to meet union leaders who represent the 3,500 workers in France, Germany, Spain and the UK who work on the A380s. It didn't go so well economically and Airbus went a bit wrong in their planning. Unfortunately, the calculation didn't work out. That happens from time to time and you have to live with that. When Emirates takes delivery of the last A380 in 2021, Airbus will have sold 313 Super Jumbos. It's far fewer than the 700 planes officials had once dreamed would dominate the skies. Paolo Montesilio, TRT World.